now. On October the 26th of 2021, um, my 21-year-old son lost his battle um, of his life to COVID. On blessings, blessings everyone. So it's bloody representing. So in this video, I will speak about a mom who mourns the death of her son who passed away because of COVID-19 and some other topics. So before we move on to all of the topics of this video, I want to do something that I promise to do in all of my videos, which is to pray for my viewers. So Father God, may I beg your guide and protect all of my viewers. Bless my viewers, cover them, remove all negative energy from out of our life father god cover us with positive energy god bless us give my viewers strength knowledge wisdom place them father god may i beg you just protect them protect them and guide them father god guide them to the righteous path father god and keep them safe bless them family bless them house all Bless them, Father God, and fill them with positivity. Make them be the source of positive energy, Father God. I may I beg you, at least one viewers who is watching this video, may I beg you, transform them life, Father God. Transform them life, and we give thanks for your blessing for everything we have done for us. We give thanks for life, life, and the greatest blessing, Father God. So I want to say thank you, Father God, for all your blessing. Them. I appreciate the love. And my viewers appreciate the love. Give thanks, Father God. Bless my viewers, them, and transform them life into something positive and bless. Thank you, Father God. Give thanks. All right, my people. So it's time to move on to the athlete who passed away. So first thing that I will do is to make you hear the speech of his mother, right? And then the news narrator will also give you some more information about the situation. And after. I will give my opinion about everything. All right, so I'm gonna play the clippings for you or the video for you right now. Mother, that's how Lakeisha Baron Brown remembers her son, John Tavius Omari Brown. On October the 26th of 2021, um, my 21-year-old son lost his battle um, of his life to COVID. On Friday, Baron Brown was giving back to the community she says her son loved so much, providing free turkeys and canned goods for Christmas dinners with the help of the KJ Foundation and the local Charleston fraternity. C Alpha Omega C5. But it was more than just food for Brown. Free COVID-19 vaccinations were also being offered by the Partnership of African American Churches. And so we know food, we need that for the nourishment of our body, um, for healthy, but also I know for the sake of the vaccine, we also need the vaccine to help save one's life as well. She says her son was not vaccinated. Um, some fear of what the vaccine may, um, the unknown. I think was some of the hesitation that my son had not to get vaccinated. Although Brown was in the hospital battling kidney disease, she believes had he been vaccinated, he could have had a longer fight for his life when he contracted COVID-19 weeks into his hospitalization. First thing more officer everyone is rest in peace. You know, but no said this is a very sad moment for the family. I heard that he passed away leaving a children right or a child better early said and you know that's very sad because that's another child who will grow up without a father you know and he was just 21 years old you know john who started me tell you say really messed up and people i'm gonna say right now is that just live righteous live positivity Live positive, live positive, live positive, do the right thing, everyone. Stay away from trouble, stay away from violence. You understand me? Just do the right thing, everyone. Because, end of the day, when certain things choose for happen, you don't have no control over it. Because, sometimes certain sickness, you don't even have no control over it. It just happens. So. People are say, you're unlucky. You understand me, but Jano, Jano, man, there is a people. The greatest blessing for all of us who is watching this video, what we have is life. I always tell the people, I say, once you have life, you're good. Life are the greatest thing above all things. When you talk to Father God, if you tell Father God, say, give thanks for life. If you believe in a God, everyone want to say, Thank you, Father God, for life right now. Everybody does say, Father God, 
give thanks for life right now you understand me you are grateful for things like that life life so everyone give thanks for life my condolence to all his loved one rest in peace all right now so it's time to get into the money so remember you now this is an additional thing with all of my video which is to speak about at least making money from e-commerce forex and job shipping so everything i just said a while ago are online business and right now online business are going to take over the world you realize say when at the time them people them where i do call center work them they have to go at a workplace you know them have to get out get up out of them bed sorry <laughs> and go somewhere and do them call center business now them there them yard and them can run them call center business school online school so everything is becoming an online lifestyle so online business is the future and you see job shipping forex flip bank e-commerce is all online business so let me give you a quick rundown now so e-commerce is basically selling products online forex is basically buying currency and selling it back right so then they are online business job shipping same thing selling products and that is what these and they make crazy amount of money it started off doing because their secondary way of income till it become the why i'm making so many mistakes till it become their primary source of income right so you can make a lot of profit from it so people need to you know, do one thing for me right now and to invest the time in learning about online business trust me it's go worth it right learn something is i learn something which is you should offer more service than you receive and i want to do this in all of my video which is to tell my people about online business and make them learn these things right so this is just me doing my people a favor why i chose to bring up this in all of my videos so more people can get into things that it, it that is way better for them than doing a 95 so people will check out online business a good something trust me yeah Alright my people, so last thing of this video is the motivation. Motivation time, let's get motivated. So first thing, consistency is key. I tell the people like this, no matter where you go through, you have to always remain consistent. You understand me? Always remain consistent. Remember you know, the scenario that I always preach? Because some people probably think I preach my preach. If you try, knock off a door, you knock it five times, you probably not budge. But yeah, be consistent and guess what when you create a plan when you create a plan it go well because the plan give a direction you understand me so you go so boom now you try to knock off the door and you knock it fire and you realize it now moves so you create a plan and you say all right you go for your armor you go knock off this one and then you be consistently pushing it eventually it will break, break off you understand me eventually it will boss off anyway you want to put it some people are going to say why i'm say boss off but anyways consistency and creating a plan is key to success in any person's journey you understand me so bloody representing thanks for watching peace and love i'm out